Hey guys, we're just a couple of days away from Easter, so I wanted to take a moment uh, to get us thinking deeper about the, the weekend that is ahead of us. Uh, I wonder what's on your mind and on your heart as you approach this weekend. Maybe for some of you, you're going away and you're stressing right now about packing the car, uh, getting everything ready for the family camping trip. Maybe you still haven't bought your eggs and you're planning that Easter egg hunt with the kids. I don't know what it is that's on your mind or on your heart. Maybe you're just thinking about an opportunity to have a break, uh, to rest with the people that you love uh, and take some time. I wonder what it is that's on your heart and mind. It's so easy for us as we approach Easter, particularly in a church setting as pastors and leaders, to be fixated on the what it is that we have to achieve. We've got to run services. There's, there's a whole bunch of stuff that has to happen. But as I've been diving into the scripture this week and, and praying and seeking God and saying, what is it that you want us to be speaking into this Easter? I've been captivated by this one particular passage. In Luke chapter nine, verse 51, it says this, when the days drew near for him to be taken up. So as Jesus was drawing near to the end of his ministry on earth, it says he resolutely set out towards Jerusalem. I love that idea that here's Jesus, the Son of God, who came, we know at the beginning of his ministry, it says that he opened up the scroll and he said, you know, this is my purpose, this is why I'm here. And as ministry goes on for him, as he approaches this moment in time where he's about to set his face towards the cross and all that he has come to achieve, it doesn't say that he meandered towards Jerusalem, it doesn't say, that he uh, hesitantly went towards Jerusalem. Now the scripture says that Jesus resolutely set out towards Jerusalem. He went with intent. He had purpose in the passion. I wonder for us this Easter, if we're thinking about purpose. Are we thinking about the purpose behind family gathering? Are we thinking about the purpose behind an Easter egg hunt with the family? Are we thinking about the purpose behind a time and a season for rest? Or are we just doing what we do because it's what we've always done? Can I encourage us, all of us, this Easter to think about purpose? Whatever it is that you have planned this Easter, approach it with intent. Think more deeply, look beyond the surface and go deeper and say, Lord, what are you wanting to teach me in this moment? How are you wanting me to invest in family, friends, uh, even in myself? What is it that you are wanting to do in my life as I pause and I reflect on what you did for humanity, what you did for creation, what you did for salvation? Jesus resolutely set out towards Jerusalem. He came with intention and purpose and he fulfilled the passion with that deep, powerful, glorious, sense of purpose. May we be a people who live in that purpose and reflect upon him this Easter, giving him all the glory and giving him our lives for all that he has done. Friends, we're praying for you this Easter. Whatever it is you're up to, why don't you let us know? Comment below, how's God ministering to you? Uh, we would love to connect with you. We would love you to go deeper in the word and deeper in community and most importantly, deeper in Christ. God bless, have an amazing Easter, and um, our prayers are with you.